Hello and welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, let us see how to calculate the wavelength of uh, Balmer alpha line in hydrogen spectrum. Uh, so when electron jumps from higher orbit to lower orbit, uh, lower energy orbit, it will emit energy in the form of photons. So those photons have a particular wavelength. So we can see here different orbitals and uh, uh, different names given for different transitions. So, for example, if uh, electrons jump from higher orbitals like n equal to 2, 3, 4, so on up to infinity to the first orbital n equal to 1, then it is Lehman series. So, here uh, from 2 to 1, it is called Lehman alpha and 3 to uh, 1, it is Lehman beta and from 4 to 1, Lehman gamma and so forth. Similarly, here also. Uh, in case of Balmer, the transition is from higher orbits to n equal to 2, second orbit. So here, uh, 3 to 2 is the Balmer alpha and 4 to 2 is uh, beta and 5 to 2 is gamma. So Balmer alpha is the transition from n equal to 3 to 2. So we have to calculate the wavelength for this particular transition. And so there are other uh, transitions and uh, series uh, like passion series, bracket and fun and, and so on. So here, uh, for us, these are important in case of hydrogen. So here uh, to calculate Balmer alpha, the initial orbit is Ni is 3 and it is jumping to final orbit, that is second one. So this is the formula for calculating the wavelength of emitted photon where 1 by lambda is the wavelength. This 1 by lambda is equal to R into 1 by Nf square minus 1 by Ni square. Here Nf and Ni, as you know, these are the orbits value. And R is the Rydberg constant. So for derivation of this Rydberg constant, I will give in the description um, and in the comments. Uh, do check it how to calculate the Rydberg constant. Uh, we can represent Rydberg constant as R or Rh. So both uh, notations are same. Uh, so RH or R in both ways we can represent Rydberg constant. So when we substitute Ni is equal to 3, Ni is equal to 3 and Nf is equal to 2 and the Rydberg constant value here 1097, uh, 737.31.6 per meter. So when we calculate that we get uh, 6.56 into 10 power minus 7 meter that is 656 nanometer. So this is a wavelength uh, of emitted photons. Uh, so this is what the Balmer alpha line give value for hydrogen spectrum. So this is only applicable for hydrogen uh, spectrum. Okay, so this is how we calculate the wavelength of Balmer alpha line. Thanks for watching and uh, please do check description for, for the videos of uh, helium Sorry, it is a singly ionized helium spectrum. So singly ionized atom has one electron because it, it has two electrons, but when it is singly ionized, it will have only one electron. So do check out uh, the video regarding that as well. Uh, thank you and do subscribe to get more relevant videos. Thank you.